Yeah, so um, we are continuing the discussion over here, so now. Put on my glasses now. Um, we are waiting for some more other people. Somebody just sent me one clip in of the video with, with Shensia and um, Megan the Stallion. See? I want to ask Shensia. All right, people, I know Shensia, you know, before she even become a star and thing. But you know, stardom, hardly see her. She could have fly a private jet now, so we don't book up in an airport or nothing. Because. Whosoever you hear me and them have any ads or you hear some foot on a person in a talk. Sometimes why me and them the reason that you when I see each other. Because if me see them, I'm not afraid to go to them and say, what go on? How oh, you do that? How oh, you do that? Because I saw me stay. I like talk behind people. But I don't see Shensia for the longest. See? Them live in Florida. I live in Florida. But them live at the rich part. And I me me live at the nearly rich part. So me and them don't really see each other. Yeah? And more time where them go, me not go. See? But Muda like ask Shensia if this is what you wanted to reach the top four. Is this, is this what your mission was? Are you proud of yourself? Let me block that person. Yeah, well, uh. Yeah, so one more answer, see? Me want to know if she proud, like you're proud at that moment here, yeah? like this is what you want, your legacy to read, like when like Nadine Sutherland and Terra Fabulous are going to have action, not a bag about sweet, action, not a bag. You see me? When you're going to have um, Bounty Killer with poor people fed up, when you're going to have Beady Man with Sim Sima, when you're going to have Lady Sir with so much sangue, you know? You're going to have Baby Sham with, we get the thing them, they move to look now. You know what I say? When 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 you have Cape and left, left from Jamaica go over in Pantor, preaching, teaching the you know? When you have turned to me and Devante with everyone falls in love sometime as a crossover it when you have so many different um it songs where we'll never stop playing. You know what I mean? Like you want your legacy for read, say all you do I promote homosexuality and nastiness that you are your legacy for read when you done you want to say your time at the top was spent demoralizing the culture and embarrass where the people in before you work for Sean Paul give me the light um so many it's when one that know letting go um Junior gang welcome to jam rock all of these crossover songs will have so much meaning and morals and sentimental value to our culture. You want your thing to be. You did come be the epiphany and nastiness and demonic behavior. That, that's what you want to, to be remembered as. This is what you want to. Vegas' biggest song. Heads I kill him with you now. Meaning, he's opposed to woman giving blowjob. That's one of Vegas' biggest song. At least, that is Vegas' biggest song. Cabra Girl Flex, time to have sex, biggest song. What are you doing? We are, what are you doing? This is what you want to represent at the top of the game? This is where you want. So, obviously, honestly, I am going to speak. People who know say, me just talk truth, right? 
I don't think Shensia write that song. I don't think Shensia write that song. No, it seems to me that Shensia is just being a headless fool. It's like she's just a puppet and a string without any soul, moral, vision, anything what she wants to for herself. I know Shensia. I've heard amazing material with Shensia. Nobody will write the song down here, Shensia. Shensia is complying. Listen, nobody can force you to go in a studio and sing that. She agreed to sing in it. Even if somebody write it, the record company will push forward their narrative. But it's you who have to stand up and decide, I don't want to be a part of that kind of thing. She decided to do it. And then, after the song is written and recorded, mixed and mastered, they do a video. And based upon when we see another little piece of video there, she is actually telling the world that she's a lesbian and that's what they are promoting. Okay? So, I am not going to blame the man I met the rhythm. I am not going to blame the man who write the song. I am not going to blame the record label for wanting to push in that narrative because they are on that agenda. I am going to blame Shensia and her team. The people them were advisor. The people them were say, yes, this is a good idea. Because sometimes when you are leading, you need good associates and you need good people around you to give you proper advice. No. This is what I want Shensia to always remember. You are not going to be the most talk about artists all the time. You are not going to be at the top of the table all the time. Life changes and there are different seasons for different people all the time. What you do with your time is very important. Now, what you are doing with your time is creating an awareness now in the present, but it will cripple you in the future now as far as i see what is going on in music today our people are forgetting the main important thing of your existence in the music business and i'm going to show you what is the most important thing in in the game one thing you must never forget never i'm going to show you hold on because I don't think... I think they need a cool reminder. I think they need a, a cool reminder. So let me give you a cool reminder. Let me give you a cool reminder. This. This is the cool reminder. This. Hold on. Let me show you. I want to show you something. Because these people keep forgetting what is going on i go and give another cool reminder when i said this this is the most important thing as an artist as a producer as a selector this this yes sir, is the most important thing so even when you sit down with kanye west when you sit down with Megan Thee Stallion, when you sit down with Nicki Minaj, when you sit down with Marilyn Manson, when you sit down with Russell Simmons, when you sit down with Busta Rhymes, when you sit down with Jay-Z, when you sit down with Beyonce, this must always be at the top of your memory box. That's something, yeah. this. Hey, hey, that, you see that flag here? Yeah? And where it stands for? And where we grew up on? I eat for there at the top of your brain. This. That Jamaica flag here. Means say. You are going to remember. Oh, you grew. 
Remember what your principles of growing up. It no matter if your address change. Your mindset. Your inner spirit. Oh, your values where you grew up and nothing change. Anytime you figure this and not care about where. Yes, sir. When you don't care about where yes or think, it's over for you, you know. If you don't know and care about where yes or think, I think them lose focus on what the mission is. I hear the new excuse is. Y'all listen to me? The new excuse is. Oh, may have all kind of fans. Me do music. No, you don't do music. You don't do music. You do not do music. You know what you do? You do dance all and reggae music. It's a big difference. Wanna listen to me? Me don't want an artist come tell me say them do music. You do not do music. You do reggae and dance hall music. Big difference. Big, 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 big difference. You do not, let me repeat. You do not do music. You do reggae and dance hall music. Big difference. Do not tell me that you do music and you have all kind of fans. You don't. I'm going to explain to you now. One and I understand. Them say, we don't do eight music. Yes, we do eight music. What do you miss somebody a comment about, we don't do eight music. Yes. Reggae and dance hall is Eight music. Ask me how. Come on, know the, the fans them in tune. Ask me how. We do eight music. We not do music for everybody. We do not do music for everybody. Reggae and dancehall is not done for everybody can i tell you everybody love reggae and dancehall but reggae and dancehall is not done for everybody me repeat myself me repeat myself reggae and dancehall is not done for everybody but Everybody love reggae and dancehall. You know why I explain now? You know why we explain? Okay, let me explain to you. Because they are getting into the business of music and don't understand the purpose of our music. Reggae is the biggest eight music in the world. Reggae signifies love within black people. Everybody else except black people supposed to eat reggae. You hear that? Everybody except black people supposed to eat reggae. Reggae bun queen, bun slave master, bun corruption, bun pastor, bun the poor, bun politician, bun batty boy. Bon sodomite, reggae, bon everything. Reggae is seen as righteous music for black people. Guilty white people, guilty Indian, guilty Arab, gravitate and love reggae because they know it's the truth. More understand what I'm saying now. Because obviously, you don't blood clot understand. What we music is our we sing hate music. We hate corruption. We hate 
Batman, we hate lesbian, we hate raper, we hate thief, we hate man who kill innocent people, we hate the judicial system, we hate Babylon, we hate the queen, we hate the pope. Reggae is hate music. Some of the nobody tell me about, oh, so what? We're doing hate music now. We've been doing hate music from the beginning. We hate oppression. Hold on, people. Oh. We've been at the hate music. Hold on. Nobody not tell me about calm down. Nobody not call my phone and tell me about calm down. Me I talk the truth now. Because enough man I do the music and don't know what's the significance of the music. Remember, say our music help free Africa from apartheid. See? Our music help get rid of President Bota out of Africa. Remember, our music help free Nelson Mandela in the struggles. See? We have been doing eight music from the beginning. Bob Marley do eight music. Peter Tosh do eight music. Jimmy Cliff do eight music. Brigadier Jerry. Charlie Chaplin. Josie Wheel. All of them and their eight music them used to do. You ride the whole of them on our come talk about. Let's recall some great man who've been fighting for our rights. Burning spirit, the whole of them are hate music we do. We do live music, but it's for black people. We never sing for everybody. Because we never do a sing for we oppressor them. We did a sing against we oppressor them and become great. So when you are gonna tell me, say, you are the music. I are the music for everybody. Don't do that. Do not tell me that. Tell somebody who can read and write that. Tell some unintelligent person that when I have no IQ. Reggae and dance hall has never been for everybody. Everybody love it. But it's not for everybody. When you go to Europe and keep a show, it's full of white people. The music where they rock to them supposed to eat it. But here why they not eat it now. Hear why them not hate the music now? Because them know it's the truth. Them know it's the truth. You understand what I say? So don't tell me. Say I do music for everybody. If one artist come on a live yeah, listen to me good enough. If one artist come on a live yeah, and tell me, say, when them did I do music and I try bust, them did I do music for please shaky people. And people were in the alphabet world and them think they said, Oh, when me that do music, me that did for everybody. And me that try win over shaky people and me that try make everybody love me. One artist tell me that. More one artist turn the life and tell me that. More one person where in a music where boss. Tell me, say, when they made the music of Jamaica and Hungary, I kill them. And them I write them song. And I go record them first song. Them did a thing, say, yo, more alphabet people love this. And me no want to offend nobody. Tell me that. One. Just one artist more tell me that. One. Find one who can tell me that. One. Dec me, me never want to find two, you know. One. Just find one artist where did that tell me, say, yo, dog, me now go say that come, you go offend them people there over England, and you go offend them people over America, let me change this. No, no, no. Not one of you that think about that. Not one of you. So, oh no. When you reach a big platform, where you to sing about the culture, and sing about the liberty in a Jamaica, and the way how we live in a Jamaica. When you don't reach from the high platform when the culture put on the sun now, you not gonna start telling me now so I try to sing for everybody. So how oh, anybody that sing for everybody when they want boss? So how oh, now your boss you turn your back on the culture? Shensia, is this what you want for your life? I think 
this display, what Shen said, though, is a disgrace. People want to understand me now. And listen to me carefully. Listen to me carefully. I absolutely love Shen Sia. I want to listen to me, God. I am not saying this with any any ill motivation. May I say this from my heart. I know Shensia before she became an artist. She always could have DJ and everything. I absolutely love her and check for her before that. So I'm not frightened. I'm not frightened. Or I eat panar or none of those things. I want the best for Shensia. But you are not going to tear down the moral values and the branding of our culture for true me know you and true me rate you. Me not going to say nothing. This is a disgrace. You get the big platform now. People, more and listen to me. More and listen to me. Listen to me. Listen. 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 Shensia is very talented. Very, 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 very talented. When she got England over the big record company, I think it was Universal or one of them placed them. Zin, Ramesh play some song for me where she record over there. People, if you don't hear them song there, if you don't hear them song there, not one of them put out. Not one of them put out. Not one of them sang the put out dog. So what me I say is no. I think. And this is not the first way I see it. You know. Street approved. You probably can attest to this. This is not the first time. We have seen. A Jamaican artist. Dominating the space. Spark the interest of international record labels and company get signed and from them signed till now not even one of the songs with the international company put out don't it no matter how big the name is that them collaborate with not one of the songs them not it it come to the last a week last a week and a half two weeks gone last a week week and a half two weeks three weeks gone last one week gone because once them sign you know, it come like them are signing for flap you. I saw me kind of feel about it now. Cause these companies see you I dominate the space. See you I make hits. See you I do you show them. I interested in you. But when them sign you know, them fire your manager, them run where who produced the hit song and make them know you. Them run where who used to write your song. Them start telling you how to dress, how to talk, put content in your music whenever in your music. So, obviously, they might try to mash you up. It can't be help. It has to be destruction. It cannot be help. It would have better, the record company, you know, we have put out them songs with Shensia, Carl Jordan, Carl Jordan and her it already, Carl Elvis, because Elvis and her it already, Actually, I used to produce two songs. Um, Russian, can this never sound like a Russian produced this? I think these record companies are the real in the Jamaican talent. They must mash them up. They must mash them up. Them give a piece of money. Cause two you not used to this money. Them give a piece of money. You know two you want hype and hear as a Jamaican artist. Them say you sign. I have this big food and I are on the place. You take it. So first thing for you going at the meeting. Them tell you okay. We have um, George Kilpatrick. He's a writer. He write for Usher. He write for Jay Z. He write for Damon Dash. He write for Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson not do dancehall. Usher not do dancehall. Damon Dash not do dancehall. Jay Z not do dancehall. You are a dancehall artist. So this writer don't have no use in a year studio session. Him I gonna make a right fuckery. 
Z, them supposed to go for Clint, dance all writer, Patex, dance all writer, or Carl Dexter, that's making him write two songs for you, or Carl Red Rat or Goofy, or some people write Jamaican hit song. Call them and come make him write two songs for you. If you're a writer, you need. Warm to the writer, they made write this song. We make it, we make them see you. Oh, yeah, God, that's everything we make them see you. And pick up being new people. Oh, that work. Angel Doulas, give him a contract. Get people who can write with them brain in our culture. Obviously, them people are write things for you when you go with the culture. That's why the song them now it. People, if I foolish this me attack on the talk to me you now. If me attack things when I make sense to tell me you now. Shensi I put out. Yeah, I'm so blessed, 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 blessed. And it look like it there gonna happen. From the video drop and our hardcore fan base is a shana girl wake up out of bed the song turn back. See? She come back with run run run. Something like that. Run 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 left. And it look like the song run left her. It no bad it. She dropped Dolly last week. I come like Chucky I did Dolly or something. The best song she have from she signed. Is you now go hold me down? Hey, never you alone. Can't tell where fido, where figo. Uh, and if you might watch out, you catch it in my waist, man. And if you might, uh, uh, in my waist, man. Zoom them, produce it. Jamaica can produce again. Where you need glasses? You're blind. You're blind. We are selector. We know what really it from a really player. Some people play some song car, yeah, them want Rami sister, them are play too Shensi and yeah, them are big friend and them want when Rami see them, them laugh up and glass up. Me and just attack the truth. The best song for Shensi for the longest while at Zoom song. How the African man got? The best song for Shensi for the longest while at Zoom song. Now you get this big opportunity. Oh yes, my apologies. The song with she and Taros. But show me a talk about Shensia song. Remember that song there, a Taros song. Hold on, Jamaica call. Hold on. Hold on. People, me just take a call a while ago. And it's a dangerous call. I'm going to tell you where the person call and ask me. I'm going to want nobody call my phone. After this. He had a man to me a while ago. One of my brothers in Jamaica. Zin, he had a man. So, Futa. So, all I selected them are running Ramish sign. Them have to play that song. Would you say? Would you say? Me, mama! <laughs> you know, I'm not taking them work, Carl. Yo, you know, I'm not taking them work, Carl. 